Erongo Regional Police Commander Commissioner Andreas Nelumbu said that the curfew is part of various interventions to curb the further spread of the virus due to an upsurge of COVID-19 cases at the coast. The same set of stage 3 restrictions now applies to Okahanja, Vanduk and Riaboth. The increasing number of COVID-19 cases and uh, death, death as a result of COVID-19 should remind us all it is, it is up to each one of us to bring a change in a positive direction. Nelumbu also said that the curfew requires people to stay at home between 8 in the evening until 5 o'clock in the morning. He also stated that the punishment for disobeying or refusing instruction from an authorized officer is a fine not exceeding $2,000 or imprisonment of six months or both. And said the curfew is fully enforceable from the 4th of August. If a person is found on the street without a valid reason and refuses to go home, they will be taken to the police station and charged. A case must be open and the accused should be issued with a fine and informed to appear in court. Nelumbu emphasized that the country is in a critical stage and called on the public to adhere to the health regulations. According to Inspector Eleni Shapumba, the commander for community affairs, the patrol, which included high-ranking officials, went fairly well, with only a few incidents recorded of residents found on the streets without valid reasons. Shapumba added that patrols would continue and advised those in other parts of the region to also adhere to the curfew.